Rhythm is like a river flowing along, nice and smooth. You haven't played anything. When you mark a note, you impose yourself on the flow of time. When you play the next note, you've imposed yourself again, and the distance between that note and that note is called rhythm. The distance between the two. So you must be careful you don't interrupt the flow of time. You have a big responsibility. Many times I've been to the club to hear the group, and the band's playing great. Everybody's on the dance floor dancing, and then something goes wrong. See if you can spot what goes wrong. Feels great. One, two, three, four. Oh, it's great. Yeah, everything's fine. Everybody's dancing. One, two, three, four, one. And then something goes wrong. What happened? The young musician played a drum fill. But he got all nervous and tense, and he interrupted the flow of the music. So the drum fill must try to set up a question which it resolves. Try like a juggler to throw the balls in the air and then release the tension when you come back down on the downbeat. Maybe it would be better if he had done it a bit more like this. Two, three, four. So next time you get up with your group, you think about the river of time, be careful where you impose yourself and where you take yourself out.